Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. Yesterday I reported about some discrepancies you could see in the Hearthstone card library on the official Blizzard site, including Theotar the Mad Duke showing up as a 6 mana 4 4 instead of the 5 mana 3 3 that it currently is on live. And now Blizzard went ahead and confirmed that yes, in patch 25.0, so when the expansion launches, there will be two nerfs. One nerf will be to Teotar, and the other one will actually be to Ice Revenant. Currently the card library is down, so I couldn't get the graphic if it's changed there, but Ice Revenant, which is currently a 4 mana 4 5 elemental, whenever you cast a Frost spell gain plus 2 plus 2, it's only going to gain plus 1 plus 1. So they have changed the effect a little bit on that one, and those two will be the only nerfs that are coming in patch 25.0. And here is Blizzard's official explanation posted by Kurt Ocker. Hello everyone. Along with our major announcements this Tuesday, we updated our website's card library to include new cards from the Death Knight class, March of the Lich King expansion. Additional Death Knight deck building has been enabled there to allow for early theory crafting. We're aware of an unexpected issue where we leaked everything uh, with the implementation of this feature that has caused some cards to show up with different stats than their in-game counterparts. The inaccuracies do not reflect planned changes to these cards, with the exception of Theotar the Mad Duke and Ice Revenant. Those two changes will arrive without 25.0 update. So I also reported that there were multiple other discrepancies, which I thought were just mistakes because they were old versions of cards, and that turns out to be correct. Those are not reflective of future changes. And then they have some comments. The release of a new class is an incredibly exciting moment for Hearthstone players everywhere, at a moment that we want to be as enjoyable and accessible as possible. Knowing the importance of this new class release, our plan with Theotar was to test out a small nerf to the card before potentially moving to a larger nerf. Theotar's play rate did not drop as far as we would have liked it with small nerf, and it's still much higher than we would like it to be leading into March of the Lich King. Our aim with this second nerf is to lower the card's play rate to ensure that the release of Death Knight is as fun as possible. Hey Blizzard, I have a free tip for you. If you want to lower the play rate of a card, I mean, you know what to do. It will give all of your charge minions plus one attack. That's the perfect solution. Teotar, play rate will plummet. Trust me. Trust me. I, I know what I'm doing. Then. The nerf to Ice Revenant might appear out of place, but it feels like a necessary one in a world where Death Knight has access to multiple cheap Frost spells. In testing we were frequently seeing Ice Revenant's game-ending size on turn 4, and the card was simply overshadowing many of the new and exciting things going on in the set. That was a fun one, and that was a good catch from Blizzard. Uh, so, yeah, two nerfs coming, patch 25.0, so that's going to be in December. At the start of December, when the new expansion launches. As traditional, leaked by Blizzard, but out of tradition, also now confirmed by Blizzard. Thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe if you enjoyed this, and a special thanks to all of my Patreon supporters, YouTube members, and Twitch subscribers who make all of these videos possible.